I am Katie. I'm Douglas. And this is Balboa. Balboa. We didn't cover that specific move, but we covered some cool stuff. Yeah, we did. Yeah. We did. Uh, so this is the second month of Balboa at Wednesday Night Hop. Uh, this is June. June, June 2015. And we are covering just sort of a mishmash of stuff. Um, a little bit of a continuation from last month, but we are starting from the ground up. Yeah, some really good basics that we can build upon, fundamentals, put together and make it your own. So we started with some the basics. ground up, the b some basics, uh, yeah. and we even went below the basics and just talked about yeah. side steps. Where we kind of focused on gathering and our warm up. Gather so. step, gather step, gather, gather step, and single steps. Yeah. Just Move, changing your weight on each beat. And we practice and we doing that forward we and backwards. Back. We practice doing it to the side. Yeah. Yeah. All good stuff. And then we also cover the uphold basic. Yep. So I will show you that with my back to you. And we'll switch around. For the follows. Five, six, seven, eight. Four, One, together, two, three, four, five, together, six, gather. seven, eight. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. So you can two, see. Three, four, five, six, hopefully, you seven, can see eight. that this is actually just made of those things we were doing before: single steps and these gather steps. So after we did that, we, we partnered put it, up. Uh, actually, oh. let me do it from the back, yeah, just yeah. so and people I'll do have it a reference. Actually, I'll do it sideways. Five, so you can see that angle six, too. seven, eight. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Two, three, and follows, four, I talked five, about six, seven, also eight. practicing this in place so that I can move in any direction so that I'm also not already setting that forward backward movement but letting my lead decide that and that as soon as I start to feel my lead go forward or backwards or side to side that I'm very receptive to that movement and ready to go. Cool. Yeah. Uh, we talked about connecting. I find a really nice way to connect is to hug. just give somebody a nice hug uh, and then stand and then stand up. Yeah. So we have plenty of space through our shoulders. We're not hunching in. We're not leaning back. We also, if Doug will put his back to the camera, have space between our feet. We also talked about putting our heels together a little bit as opposed to out here, but together and a little bit of turnout with toes out. Yep. Uh, yeah, and so then we did the basic connected. Follows, I really want you to make sure to keep that chest connection with the lead so that I can feel Doug move forward, back, side to side. So from there, we started taking some of the ideas we had in uh, the warm up and putting them into our partner dances. So we did this, which is called scoots. And these are just sideways steps. And after you've done them for a while, you can come out of them. We're starting with the beginning of a basic and then taking steps to the side, right, left for leaders. And then when you're ready, you can finish your basic, the five, six, seven, eight of the basic we just did. Yeah, so we really focused right on over. being ready for that on the three, four for leads mm -hmm. and follow still maintaining that chest to chest connection and also feeling uh, the connection on the arm and around the back of your lead so that I can feel this side movement, right? And then feel when that ends. Yeah, so I feel that there's it. a change of direction. So I feel sideways and then I start to feel a basic again. Yep. Yeah. So we took that same idea for side steps and applied it to going forward. These are called forward progressives. Uh, we talked about how you can sort of think of this as a continuation of the basic, uh, like a record scratching on the five, six. One, two, three, four, five, six, 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 seven, eight, two, three, four. Yeah, and another thing we added for people that have already covered some of these moves and wanted to try to add some extra texture to their basics, try fanning your foot a little bit. And again, you might shift your weight back a little bit onto your heel for that. Um, just a for little, the, little yeah, bit, little but little bit. still the intention of your body yeah. is forward. Most of your weight is on the yeah, floor. Yeah, most, most of your weight is on the ball of the foot and making that forward intention connection. Mm. Yeah. Mm. And the fans aren't super huge, but you can play with size a little bit. 
Yeah. Yeah, so we briefly covered uh, using weight changes to reverse these movements. So if we're doing scoots to the right, we use a resting weight change or a weight change that changes our direction by stopping and then going in the other direction. Shift. And we left that as mostly an exercise for you guys to play with. Yeah. So we'll come back to that and other cool things next week.